20 years ago, I donated my blood plasma to help burn victims. Two weeks after donating it, I woke up with night sweats. And then I discovered that uh, I was exposed to hepatitis B. Possibly from uh, donating my plasma to help burn victims. At the time, I thought, oh my gosh, I, I'm, I must have done something wrong with God. I must have offended God somehow. I, I, uh, and I wondered, what? You know, I really didn't know. I thought, you know, I got, hep I got a, a virus by not fagging off or shooting needles or having sex, etc., etc. Uh, very, you know, you know, uneventful type of life, I guess you could say. And then I get hepatitis B by donating my plasma, you know. I mean, I thought, wow. Then it dawned on me that the Bible says the rain falls on the just and the unjust. That uh, God does not respect our persons. Uh, story of the prodigal son where the guy goes, you know, and uh, out uh, doing whatever and comes back and the king loves him or the, the, the father loves him. You know, whereas the uh, good brother stays, the, the older brother stays at home. You know, kind of disappointed. And, uh, and then there's Job, who was a righteous man, yet uh, had all hell break loose on him when uh, God and Satan uh, got into a game to test him, to see uh, if God was right about how he would not curse him if uh, he let Satan do everything except kill him. And I tell you what, it was like a big weight lifted off my shoulders. You know, I thought, well, hey, as they say, uh, crap happens. You know? When the Bible says that God's a hidden God, to me that means it. Yeah. And three years ago, I thought I had bladder cancer. I was pissing blood clots. I thought, ah, oh, man. I, but you want to know something? I didn't say why me because I thought, well, why not me? You know, in the scheme of things, there's really not much. There's really not 